We have an exclusive interview tonight with District Attorney Jason Williams after his acquittal on tax fraud charges. The DA sat down one-on-one -on -one with WGNO's Kenny Lopez to talk about the trial and what's next for his office. Kenny. That's right, Curtin Susie. DA Jason Williams is a fighter. For years, he's fought for the people of New Orleans as a lawyer when no one else would fight for them. And with his own trial, the government brought against him for tax fraud. He had to fight for himself. Now that he was found not guilty, the fight doesn't end there. He says he will continue to fight crime in our city. What does it take to be this fighter that you had to be? If, I, if I've been fighting for people this long, I, I for damn sure was going to fight for my own rights. It was a long, turbulent, two-year fight. Williams' tax fraud trial and the tribulations that came along with it. It's important for us all to, you know, find that voice uh, and that inner strength to fight for ourselves. He fought prosecutors who tried to prove that he knowingly took part with his tax preparer, Henry Timothy's tax fraud. I didn't check Henry Timothy's credentials. Um, I should have. I, I took him at his word, but if, if, if I hired an electrician to come and rewire this office right now, I'm not digging in the walls to see if they do it right. I'm flipping the switch. It has changed uh, my, the, the way that I trust everyone. As DA, he says trial or not, he always was laser focused on fighting for the people in our city. Being a progressive DA, at least the way that I see it, means being fair and being smart and focusing on the crimes that matter most. Crimes like carjackings, rapes, and murders, as opposed to marijuana charges. People, when they go to trial, there's due process. It means there's a unanimous verdict uh, w from a jury. It means that evidence will never be hidden. For Williams, and, and once a fighter, a major always a fighter. I just, I really want the public to understand that we're in this fight with them. Uh, from beginning to end. And that fight certainly is not over. DA Williams went on to say more resources are needed for not only the DA's office, but the NOPD. If the NOPD's response time is shortened, the better they can collect evidence, which in turn will help the DA's office when they need that evidence for court. Hmm. Kenny Lopez with the exclusive interview. Thank you, Kenny.